Adding a password is one of the simplest ways to protect your file's contents and define how the user interacts with your file. Open your file and choose File Properties or Control plus D on Windows or Command plus D on Mac to open the Document Properties dialog box. Click the Security tab. The default shows no security. Right now, the user can make any sorts of changes to this file. Click the Security Method drop-down arrow and choose Password Security to open the Settings dialog box. The default compatibility level is Acrobat 7 and later, which we'll use. Pick the parts of the document you want protected or encrypted. Encrypting all contents means just that. Encrypting everything but metadata means the file is protected and search engines can access data about the file. We'll use that option. You can also encrypt just attached files too. There are two password types, either using a password to open the file if you want to share it with only specific people, or restricting what the user can do with the file called permissions. Let's set some permissions. Click the checkbox and type a password into the field. You'll see the strength of your password show in the colored bars. Choose the printing resolution from the drop-down list. Pick options for users from the changes drop-down list. You can allow users to change the pages, work with fields, add comments, or do anything except extract pages. You can also allow users to copy the content. Enabling text access for screen readers is selected by default, and you should leave that setting. Click OK. Type the confirmation for your password, click OK, and then click OK again to return to the document. Save the file and check it out. Notice the word secured is added to the file's name. You'll see the security settings panel shows at the left of the screen. Depending on the permissions you choose, you may or may not be able to use the tools and other program features. As you see here, I can't make page changes. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like the video.